Sixers hosting the Blazers, and the Sixers are eight and a half or nine point favorites. The over under is at 231 and a half. The Blazers are plus 285 on the money line. The Sixers are minus 375. The Blazers lost the last game they played. The Sixers have won the last three games that they've played. Before you bet on this game, go to a site like uh, VegasInsider.com and allow you to compare all the casinos' pricings in one place. Go to Twitter, go to Underdog NBA, and see what players are actually playing in this game. And then use a site like Covers.com and allow you to compare how these teams are done individually, head to head against the spread, the over under, so on and so forth. Head to head, the home team is six and four in their last ten. The Blazers are seven and three against the Sixers in their last ten. The underdog is five three and two against the spread, while the favorite is five and five against the money line. The over is eight and two in their last ten, and the under two thirty one and a half is six and four in their last ten meetings. The last game they played against each other, the Sixers won 105 to 95 in Portland as two point favorites. The game before that, the Blazers won 118 111. They were seven point home favorites. They pushed. The game before that, the Sixers won 113 103. They were two and a half point uh, road. Uh, they were two and a half point home fit underdogs. And the game before that, the Blazers won 118 114 as five and a half point home underdogs. Three out of the last four games, the home team has won. The Blazers are 4-6 and six in their last 10 overall, and they're 4-6 and six against the spread. The last two games they've played have gone under, and the under is 6-4 in their last 10. We have had 208, 214, 241, and 240 points. The last four games that they've played have been on the road. For the Sixers, the last five games they've played have been on the road. They are 7-3 and three overall, and they're 7-3 and three against the spread. The under is 5, 4, and 1 in their last 10 games. We have had 211, 290, 263, and 259 points in their last handful of games. I think the Sixers bounce back in this game. I think they win. I think they cover. And I think there's going to be a lot of points scored in this game. Sixers with the money line. Sixers laying the points and the over. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.